Hey, you're welcome. I'm very sure you must have heard the saying, cash flow is the lifeblood of any business. I also like to add, creatives are the lifeblood of any ad campaign, which means if you want to consistently get conversions, you need to keep shining out more creatives. But understand, not everybody has the resources or luxury of time to do this. And this is why I'm creating this tutorial to share with you how you can leverage your AI to show out as many creatives as possible. Now, this will save you time, save you money, and also save you energy. And in this same video, I will share with you how you can actually use all of these variation of creatives that you have created or generated with AI. Okay guys, so without further ado, let's get started with today's tutorial. Welcome back. Now, the tool we'll be using in this particular tutorial is called Adobe Firefly. I'm very sure you have heard about this. At least I've been talking about it for like two weeks now. So that is what we'll be using. So Adobe Firefly is just like the generative AI, Adobe integrated with Photoshop. I'm very sure most of you are conversant with Photoshop already. So if you do not have access to that on Photoshop, Maybe you are not using the premium version or something. You can access it online. So they make the made provision for people to access it online. And guess what? It is totally free of charge. And since I've been using it, there is no limit to the usage. So it is just amazing. Free of charge with no limit. Okay, guys. So if you come here, I would advise you create an account. But I've created mine. It is easy. Just the way you create account on any platform. So you see there are different tools here. Can you see? Uh, there is a text to image, generative field, text effect, generative recolor. Some of these are not available. 3D to image, they are not available yet. So, but for today tutorial, we'll be using this generative field. So just click on generate button. But you can just visit the link you are currently seeing on your screen. It will take you to this particular page directly. Okay guys, so once you are here, now the idea is to have your base image. So let's assume you are selling a product. In our case here, we'll be using a shoe. So this is just an example. You might be selling digital products, you might be selling physical product, and the physical product might be a totally different product. But then, once you understand the concept I'll be sharing with you in this video, you can use it for whatever product you are advertising or you want to sell okay so i'll just go ahead to upload uh the image that i'll be using so this is the image that i'll be using so i'm assuming i'm selling a shoe okay guys so this is your canvas where everything happens but this will be a very short tutorial okay so all you need to do is i'll just come to this background click on background so as you can see the background is removed so you can now decide to use any prompt you can type in any prompt tell it what you want it to do so i will start with this so let me just put um for example i will just say i can trail the word i will still explain some things then click on generate so as you can see to give you four outputs that you can choose from this is one this is another one this under one this under one and you can decide to click for more so i've got to understand the more you click on this more button the more it gets better so it's just like learning and learning better in real time you understand so to learn more about um, what you have uploaded okay so you can just play around clip clicking till you get the one you are looking for now here is the thing you can decide to just cancel so if you have no idea of the prompt to enter here, you can just leave it empty and just click on generate. So the AI will just generate from its own imagination. You understand? So that's another thing. Don't worry guys. So here is the thing. This particular tutorial is a preamble to uh, the main tutorial I'll be creating. So this one is just for business owners and advertisers, media buyers on my channel. I'll create another tutorial where I would explain some tricks, explain so many things 
all of the you see all of this insert remove pan all of these icons here i would break them down but i don't want to make this particular tutorial to be lengthy so just watch out that will be the next tutorial i will create so it will be like a full comprehensive tutorial on adobe firefly how i use it for photo manipulation and all of that so this is why you should subscribe to my channel if you are not subscribed to my channel subscribe to my channel hit the subscribe button and also give this video a thumbs up okay guys so let's continue so i just decided to show you what it can do right so if you want to keep this you just click on keep and if you want to download you click on download you understand so here is the thing let me show you um something else okay so i'll just uh, click to remove the background again so let's now try out different things that we can do here i will just say beach let's see not a long prompt just beach so the idea is for example if you are selling a product you know you can actually sell this product to different segments of your marketing audience right so for example this should now we can decide to sell it or to make it appeal to people that are interested in going to the page in the stand can you see so they can decide to download it can decide to keep and download right but i'll not be doing that i've saved some uh, images already but you get the idea right this is one uh, you can decide to download or not i can keep generating till you find something more interesting and more realistic that's the idea so the difference between this ai tool with uh using um, just any kind of editing tool maybe just removing background and all of that is you want to make this one to be more realistic that is the idea you can see it added some shadow and it makes it look like it is real like it was captured can you see guys so the idea is to have many creatives you can try out you can test and all of that okay uh so let me just try another prompt i'm just trying to show you right i've already tested this prompt okay so i'll just try uh grass feed let's see and i'll also share with you how you can come up with all of these ideas don't worry as you can see can you see so this will appeal to different segments of your market but don't worry just keep generating till you get one that looks close to perfect or even perfect can you see guys so just keep generating but i don't want to make this tutorial to be lengthy let's say concrete skate pack so let's see okay now this looks amazing look at i love this particular one in fact the first image generated made a lot of sense so you can see some of the images won't make sense but the ones that make sense just skip them can you see so this looks cool so if you like uh, to skate this might be an option for you can you see so that's just the idea the way i will share with you how you can uh, use all of this okay so uh let me try one more and that will be running track running track okay let's see okay let's see other options these are not bad okay okay hmm this looks cool okay so guys um uh, i'm very sure you understand the concept of what i've explained so let me just share with you this app in case you are trying to figure out okay what are the prompts that i can enter don't worry chargpt got you covered so just come to chargpt and brainstorm with chargpt you can tell it to suggest ideas like okay suggest so idea of this and this the kind of background stuff like that it will suggest for you so here you can see i said give me ideas of where sneakers can be worn to example beach running track so it gave me gym or fitness studio basketball court and all of that but then uh that's not what, okay i know they can be worn to these places but then i want uh surfaces in the stand so can you see? I said no, I meant surfaces like on the beach, on the running track. So before I stated beach, running track, can you see beach? Uh, let me show you beach, running track. Then I said surfaces on the beach, on the running track. So you just want to 
make it understand what you are saying so it suggested more can you see beach running track tennis court basketball court hiking trails and all of these things that it has listed here contains most of your marketing audience that will be interested in what you want to sell i hope you understand okay so when you now have all of these variations now for example let's assume i've downloaded like five variations so you ask me okay how then do you use all of these variations what you can do is this you might be asking okay now that you have all of these variations of image creatives how do you then use them so one way you can use them is if you have a main video that you want to use for your advert run it to your code audience and then create a dynamic ad do you understand create a dynamic ad and use all of these images that you have downloaded or that you have generated with ai so facebook will dynamically show all of these images to different segments of your audience so if you use it for retargeting ads campaign it will even make more sense because they will keep seeing different creatives and they will not be bored with seeing your advert and it will help you market to different segments of your audience so that's just the idea and i hope this helps so as i've said guys this is just a very basic tutorial there is so much more you can do with this particular tool but then i'll create a different tutorial on that okay guys so let me know do you enjoy this is this interesting um you can also share with me different ways in which you want to use it you can also ask me how you can use it for what you are selling if i can respond i will okay guys so that will be all for now but before you go uh if you are new to the world of ai for business marketing productivity and creativity i will advise you come to this playlist that i've created this is a dedicated playlist with many videos and i'll keep constantly updating it come to adelicasamen.com forward slash gpt